my friends welcome back welcome to all of you that are new now i have a video with tucker carlson and matt walsh two champions of the conservative case and i call them two champions of normality and the, the video will uh, talk about something horrible but i let you take a look and then we will discuss more we will change uh, impressions yeah so without further ado take a look at this video my friends and i'll uh, see you in a very short time uh, after about two minutes to uh, comment and uh, to try to understand more of what we just seen god bless you all from your host peter see you in so my friends i'm back let's uh, talk a little bit about uh, what we just seen Tucker Carlson, uh, together with Matt Walsh, uh, talking about a bombshell report on a Vanderbilt University Medical Center in Tennessee, running irreversible gender transition surgeries and hormones on minors. Irreversible is the key word here. I mean, uh, we're talking about children. Children that they think that uh, they want to transit to uh, a different gender boys to girls girls to boys now i'm not gonna go deep into this i'm not gonna talk about um, <laughs> is it possible it's not possible no 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 i'm not gonna talk about this but i'm gonna talk about uh, the sheer fact of how evil this is now this is a uh, life changing life altering uh, surgeries and they are irreversible there's no way back once you change your body once you, you do this mistake to me and you remove your breast, it's gone. And all these hormones, all these hormones that these children take, uh, puberty blockers and all this, uh, again, they have a irreversible effect and uh, they damage. These are children. Now, they are at an age in which uh, I don't think that they are sure of what they're doing. Kids, they change all the time. I used to be a child. If you are an adult now, you used to be a child as well, my friend, isn't it? How many times you thought that you want to be something and uh, in the end uh, you change your ideas. Children change all the time. Now, adults, <laughs> adults should, uh, if they want to do this, they should be allowed to do it. Uh, is their freedom, is their body. As long as they do not affect anyone else, they have the right to decide what they want to be. If they think uh, that, that they are in the wrong body, by all means, allow them to do it. What can you do? Can you stop? No, you can't. You don't have the right to stop anyone. You can tell what's right and what's wrong. Just like in this channel of mine, I tell what's right and what's wrong. And some they accept, some they don't. And life carries on. And I do not waste my time uh, trying to convince people that uh, what I'm saying is the truth and what uh, they say is not true. Many times uh, I have trolls on my channel, they come and they insult me, they call me names. I do not go uh, into a debate, uh, into an exchange of ideas with them, uh, into an exchange of words with them because I know this will be a losing battle. I'm not going to gain anything. Nothing will change. They're not going to change their opinions. I'm not going to change my opinions. It will stay the same. It will be just an exchange of negativity. Negative words. And I don't want to live in a world of negativity. The same goes here. Matt Walsh um, is a podcaster for Daily Wire. A good alternative for uh, good entertainment and not only good news. Uh, presented uh, from a non-biased uh, point of view. But this uh, podcast about Walsh, the author of What is a Woman, is a, a revolutionary. I call him this way because he certainly is a revolutionary and he gets a lot of pushback from far-left uh, radicals. He got uh, death threats, he got uh, <laughs> lots and lots of abuse on the uh, social media but he gets as well a lot of support i am supporting matt walsh <clears throat> i am supporting daily wire i'm supporting what uh, they try to do so uh, you saw this video how he gave an update and how he uh, explains more of what's happening there how uh, vanderville university medical center they even took down their website after matt walsh exposed them and they couldn't uh, 
deny the veridicity of what Matt Walsh was saying in the, his uh, report. Oh, how can they do this when uh, everything he said is the truth? Again, what I want to say and I want you to understand clear. If you are an adult and you think you are in the wrong body, by all means, do if this is what you want to do. If you are a woman and you think you are in the wrong body, then uh, try to live as a man. If you are a man and you think you are in the wrong body, then well, do it. If this is what you want, I know that uh, well, no matter what I'm going to tell you, I could come with my Christian uh, ethics. I could come uh, with my principle of life that uh, they are extracted from the Holy Scripture and I could tell you all this. I could tell you that uh, maybe it's not exactly what you're supposed to do. But you're not going to listen. So uh, if you want to do it, uh, do it. But you are an adult already. You are an adult, so you're responsible of your decisions. Good or not so good, they are your decisions. What about children? Why children? This is what this clinic is doing. Children. And in the process of doing this, they make a lot of money. Money always talks. I wonder how many of them uh, that they work there, they really care about these poor children. They might change their idea. How many they change their ideas? How many they said, I made a mistake? In the United Kingdom, for example, there was uh, something like this, a clinic, just like this uh, Vanderbilt uh, University Medical Center clinic in Tennessee. I don't know, the government shut it down because uh, many dozens upon dozens they were suing the government they were suing the nhs saying uh, why did you allow us to do this we were just children and look uh, now uh, what we did is irreversible of course they change voice and breast cut uh, these things uh, they cannot be reversed if you change your mind uh, too late that's what Matt Walsh is doing and I wanted to post on my channel as well again I want to let all of you know that uh, I am for uh, adults uh, taking uh, their decisions and then um, the consequences they will have to suffer the consequences of their, their decisions but when it's about children I think they should be banned children shouldn't be in this position to, to do this kind of surgeries, to take this kind of life-altering decisions. Children are children. Children, they are not allowed to drink alcohol. They are not allowed to vote. They are not allowed to drive cars, isn't it? Why children are allowed uh, to take decisions when it's something so life-altering, something so definitive like uh, gender transition? God bless you all my friends. I hope you understood what I mean. No hate here, just love. God bless you all and uh, take a look at uh, Matt Walsh more. You will find him on Daily Wire. Listen to him, he really deserves it. See you soon my friends and I love you all.